Hi children, welcome back. Today we are starting with a new chapter, chapter 13 that is time and temperature. Time and temperature. And in this video we are going to discuss how to convert from one unit to another unit. Okay, related to time. How to convert from one unit to another unit. You have already learned that in chapter measurement chapter. Yes, you have learned how to convert from one unit to another unit. Now here we are going to discuss with time. Okay, the units of time. Now, chapter time and temperature. First, I will just give you some relations. We know 1 hour is equal to 60 minutes. 1 minute is equal to 60 seconds. 1 day equal to 24 hours. 1 year equal to 365 or if it is a leap year, it is 366 days. Again, 1 year equal to 12 hours months and one week equal to seven days all these are related with time okay so now we are going to learn how to convert from one unit to another unit if, as i told you in the previous uh, slide you saw one hour is equal to 60 minutes so if i want to convert from a bigger unit to smaller unit remember in measurement what did we do when you wanted to convert from a bigger unit to smaller unit, you will multiply. You will multiply with the relation. What is the relation over here? 60. 1 hour is equal to 60 minutes. So, when you convert from a bigger unit to smaller unit, you will multiply. And here the relation is 60. So, you will multiply by 60. Then, again converting from a bigger unit to smaller unit. Minute is bigger than seconds. So, again you will multiply. What is the relation over there? you multiply by 60. Then coming, if you want to convert from a smaller unit to a bigger unit, smaller unit to bigger unit, you will divide and we know the relation is 60, so divide by 60. Again, smaller unit to bigger unit, you will divide by 60. Just, just keep in mind, uh, first you find, uh, first you notice which one is a bigger, which, big, which unit is bigger and which one is smaller. And then when you are converting from a bigger unit to smaller unit, you will multiply. Smaller unit to bigger unit, you will divide with the concerned relation. Okay. So, we are going to move, do the questions based on this. First one, change to minutes. Here the questions are given you in hours and in hours and minutes. Okay. You have to write the final answer in minutes. So, as I said, to convert from hours to minutes, what should we do? You have to multiply by 60. So, 2 hours, I multiply by 60, 2 into 60. What is 2 into 60? Tell me what is 2 into 6? 2 into 6 is 12. Then you add a 0 over there, so you get 120 minutes. Okay? Then, here there is a different type. You have 3 hours and 12 minutes. 12 is already in minutes, so I do not need to convert that. I need to convert only 3 hours. So, what will I do? I will write 3 into 60. Yes, because I want to convert the 3 hours to minutes. So, 3 into 60 and then I will add this 12. Okay. So, 3 into 6 is 18. So, 3 into 60 will be 180 plus 12. How much is 180 plus 12? You will get 192 minutes. Do not forget to write the unit. It is very important. 192 minutes. Okay. Then 5 hours 45 minutes. Again 5 you convert it into 60 plus 45 minutes. It is very easy to multiply. You just need to do 5 into 6. What is 5 into 6? 30. Put a 0. So, you get 300 plus 45. What is the answer? 345 minutes. Okay. M-I-N-U-T-E-S. Minutes. D question. You can do it as a homework. Question E. Six and a half hours. Six and a half hours. Here, six hours. Six you will convert. Six you will convert into minutes. 6 into 60, half hours, 1 hour is 60 minutes, so half, 30 minutes, so you get 30, 
Now, what is 6 into 6? 36. So, you get 360 plus 30. Final answer is 390 minutes. Okay, children. So, this is how you convert from hours to minutes. Question D is a homework for you. Now, next one. Change to hours and minutes. Now, you are coming back. You are given in smaller unit. You have to convert it into a bigger unit. So, what will you do? If you want to convert, you will divide. So, 820... I divide with 60. Okay, 820 I divide with 60. You can do it in the working column. 820 I divide with 60. How many times? 60 will go in 82. One time. 60 will go in 82 one time because 2 times 60 is 120. We don't need that. Now when I minus, I get 2 here and I get 2 over here. Now I will bring down 0. How many times? 6 will go in 220. You just have to look 6 and 22. 6 and 22. 6 table find a number less than 22. Yes. Which one? 6 threes are 18. So, 3 times 60 I get 180. 6 threes are 18. And then a 0 is over there. So, that's 0. So, when I minus what do I get? I get 0 here. I borrow. This is 12 minus 8. I get 40. So, my answer will be 13 hours and 40 minutes. 13 hours and 40 minutes. Okay, children. 13 hours and 40 minutes. The remainder you will rate it for 40. Okay. Now, I will do the next one. 710 minutes, you divide with 60. I want to convert into hours and minutes. So, when I divide 710 by 60, again take 6 table, find a number less than 71. No, 7 you find out. One time itself, isn't it? 6 table, a number less than 7. 6 1s are 6. So, 60 into 1 you get 60. When I minus, I get 1 here. I bring down 0. Again, how many times 60 will go in 110? Again, 1 time because 6 2s are 12. You have only 11 over here. So, again 1 time. I write 60 here. 0. Here borrow. I get 11. 11 minus 6 is 5. So, I get 11 hours and 50 minutes 11 hours and 50 minutes okay c and d you can do as a homework i'll show you the e question 400 minutes 400 you divide with 60 okay 400 you divide with 60 what do i get 400 divided with 60 okay so how many times starting with the two digit 40 40 is smaller than 60 so can i start my division no so i'll take 400 now from six table find a number less than 40 where will i get 6 6 uh, 36 so i'll take 6 into 6 6 into 6 36 and a zero of this so i get 360 now, when I minus 0, here I will borrow, this becomes 10, I get 4. So, what is the answer I am getting? 6 hours, 40 minutes. Okay? Understood, children? Now, moving to the next set of questions. Change to seconds. Here, the questions are given you in minutes. You have to convert it into seconds. So, what do you have to do? Bigger unit to smaller unit. Yes, you have to multiply. So, 12 into 60. How much is 12 into 60? What is 12 into 6? 72. So, write 72 and then you put the 0, you get the answer 720 seconds. Okay? B, you can do it as homework. 
C. I will show you C question. Here again 15 and a half minutes. 15 you will convert it into seconds by multiplying with 60. Half minute. Half minute means 60 seconds. Sorry, 30 seconds. I am sorry children. Half minute, half minute means 30 seconds. 1 minute, 60 seconds. So, half minute, 30 seconds. Now, how much is 15 into 60? That is what you have to find out. 15 into 60. So, you just find out what is 15 into 6. 15 into 6, what do you get? 3, 6, 1, 6, you get 9. So, you get 900 because there is a 0 over here. So, 15 into 60 is 900 plus 30. So, 900 plus 30 answer is 930 seconds. 930 seconds. Okay. Similarly, you can do question D and D. You can do it as a homework. Just have to multiply by 60. Okay. Now, coming to the last session. Change to minutes and seconds. Change to minutes and seconds. Again, here the questions are given you in smaller unit. You have to convert it into a bigger unit. Seconds to minute. Seconds to minute means smaller unit to bigger unit. So, what do you have to do children? You have to divide. So, 860 I divide with 60. So, see what I am going to get. Eight hundred and sixty. I divide with sixty. Starting with two digits, eighty-six. How many times sixty will go in eighty-six? We know one time because two times it will become one twenty. So one time. Okay, I'm, I get sixty here. When I minus, I get six, and I get two here. Bring down zero. Now six table. Find a number less than twenty-six. Where you get? 6 4s are 24. So, I will take 60 into 4. How much is 60 into 4? Okay. 4 into 0, 0. 4 into 6, 24. So, when I minus, I get 20. So, what is the answer I will get? 14 minutes and 20 seconds. 14 minutes and 20 seconds. Okay, children. Now, B you can do as a homework, C also you can do as a homework, I will show you question D, 345 seconds, convert it into minutes, what you have to do, divide it with 60, 345 we are going to divide with 60, so see what we are going to get, starting with 2 digits, 34, 34 is smaller than 60. So, can we start our division over here? No. So, I will take the third digit also. So, now I have my number is 345. So, what I have to do? I will take 6 and I will take 34. 6 table find a number less than 34. Where do you get? 6, 5s are 30. So, you will do 60 into 5. 60 into 5, how much I get? 5 into 0, 0. 5 into 6, I get 30. So, when I minus, I get 5 and 4 here. So, what is the answer? I get it as 5 minutes 45 seconds. 5 minutes 45 seconds. Okay. Understood children? So, what do you have to do to convert from seconds to minutes? You have to just divide. I will show you one more question that is 450 seconds. 450 you divide it with 60. See what you get. Four hundred and fifty dividing with sixty. So what you get here? Again, forty-five. Forty-five is smaller than sixty. So I'll take the third digit also. Now from six table, I have to find a number less than forty-five. Where do you get? Six sevens are forty-two. So I'll take seven times. 7 into 0, 0. 7 into 6, 42. When I minus, I get 30. So, what is the answer I get? 7 minutes, 30 seconds. 7 minutes, 30 seconds. Understood children? So, when you are converting from a 
bigger unit to smaller unit till multiplying converting from smaller unit to bigger unit you will divide this is a case for all the measurements but the number will change according to its relation okay children thank you